Hey, what's up everyone? It's Tuesday. That means it's Blues Day. <laughs> going to check out what has come out. I'm going to pick up one title for sure, if they have it. Uh, they should. It's just opened. Uh, other than that though, everything else I'm going to pass. You know, until they come down to the dollar, two dollar, three dollar bins. Like I normally do. So, stay tuned. Here we go. Yeah, I'm hoping uh, they've got the Deep Impact that came out today in 4K. Uh, enjoy that film. And that's the one I want. So, there may be some other goodies, but I'm going to stay on budget. <laughs> Wait for it to be discounted. So, it's going to be a concert hall as usual here in my state. So, I'll get what I can. Stay tuned. There she blows. All right, let's see what I can find. Nope, all the normal last week's stuff. Training days, 10 million Wakandas that are still overpriced. So all the Rockies. Criterion that I'll wait on, which I probably will never even buy in the first place. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna check the other side. Yeah, I'm looking. I'm looking, but uh, it's not on these shelves today, so I don't recall that being one that was not going to be in store, but you never know. I do like uh, 4K, they live steelbook. It's nice. Good price. Don't need it, though. And these that came out, these new Star Wars deals, I have a feeling they're going to sell out fast, but I don't really need them. I do like this, though. It's my favorite Star Wars movie ever. Man, but I'm not seeing the one I came for, so that one may be an online. Well, oh well, till the next store. Okay, I'm done. I They didn't have it out. So I went out and checked the app. I checked for other locations. It says they have them here. So I'm going back in, see if someone would go in the back and check. Like, what what's up? You guys didn't put them out or what? <sighs> hey, Best Buy sometimes. So I did pick up three other items that I didn't plan to pick up. Because I just couldn't resist. Favorites from my childhood. You might have guessed... But I'll show you later. So stay tuned. May the force be with me. All right. Round two. Success. Man, when you have to price match with their own company. <laughs> so first of all, they didn't have it out. It was in the back. Second, they didn't have it in the system. So they had to manually input the SKU. Third, the price came up wrong. $22.99. This is why I asked my buddy Bob if he'd been to Best Buy because... You know, Best Buy, they be messing with you. Be messing with your wallets. So, <laughs> I had to price match with their own company. And their manager had to come over, you know, to see what's going on and approve it. Even though he's the one that helped me get the movie. So, it's kind of strange. But, success. After going back, having to pull it, price matching. All of the above. I'll show you this one now. The Deep Impact. Love this movie, love disaster movies. Uh, I'll save the other three things that I did get for later because I'm going back out, see what else I can find. Stay tuned, here we go.
And I'm home. Okay, just quick run through with what I picked up. So I uh, was, as you saw earlier, I was able to get the deep impact, already showed you. That was fun, uh, having to go back in twice, having to pay again, having to price scan or price match, uh, wait for him to pull up from the back. It was best buy, come on. But, but because I went out, of course I couldn't resist. Um, the these are the best of the Star Wars movies. I grew up <laughs> with these. So the New Hope, The Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. The uh, 4K steel books that came out today. I couldn't resist them. Um, my favorite Star Wars movie of all time is Empire Strikes Back. Second. Return of the Jedi, New Hope, built it. It started the foundation of Star Wars for me, so I was like, those are the three to get. I loved the collector's tin editions. I actually have some Disney treasure tins myself. When I was a movie club member back when they were, you know, selling them or giving them, I can't remember how you were getting them at the time, but I do have like four or three complete. I had four or five, but I ruined them when I was younger. The tins came in handy for, for other things. So I took the tins and did. I had no idea what I was doing. So, But, you know, Deep Impact, of course, as you already seen, was the other good goodie of, their, of the day. But I'm not finished. I went, of course, picked up some more others. You know, more movies. Uh, love me some Rudy. I didn't... I. Figured out which ones I didn't have on Blu-ray, what I have on DVD. I only had a DVD, so I decided to upgrade this. Love that movie. The Edge. Uh, found that today. Grabbed it. Good deal. Long Came Polly. Love it. Funny as hell movie. Ben Stiller um, and um, Aniston. Yeah, Jennifer Aniston. I almost said Drew Barrymore for some reason. Uh great like chemistry in that movie you know funny parts uh upgrade uh i know this is being upgraded in my screen factory or whatever um but I, i'm not gonna get the 4k or whatever that's coming out this was just fine i was meaning to pick this up forever so i'm like i'm still gonna just grab it now that it's been downsized in price great movie see no evil hear no evil this has been talked about i think on um Hard copy blues, I want to say, or you know, the Vin Vin stream, something I remember this coming up on. And yes, this movie kills. It's hilarious. Uh, I love Gene Wilder and Richard Pryor movies. Uh, I love their old stuff, and that's one of the classics. Uh, I have it on a DVD with um, I want to say another U. That's another one they were together, besides Stir Crazy and Silver Streak and you know stuff like that. But uh. I wanted to upgrade upgrade that one. Uh, USS Indianapolis. Uh, this is just an okay. It's not a war really movie. I mean, it is, but sharks involved too. It's it's and it ties it all like you know training and I think if I'm not mistaken, like the training of like a war incident and then the shark stuff. So it's an okay. It's an okay movie. I just Nicholas Cage have been getting all of his work. Untraceable. This one's good. This one's fun. Um, I thought I had it, and I've passed on it many times before. So I just picked this one up finally because I figured out I didn't have it. This I only have that cool DVD edition of Unbreakable. Um, you know, little Bruce Willis, Samuel L. This is a cool movie. So got Unbreakable finally on Blu-ray. It's been out forever. Uh, Pacific Rim, I figured I already have the the sequel to Uprising, so I'm like, you know what, I don't have the first one, might as well just grab both while I can, or while I'm at it. Um, these, these are fun, fun like kaiju, you know, fighting with big mechanical, reminds me of Robot Jocks that's coming out on Arrow in that special set, which I wish Robot Jocks 
was um, just on its own individual release because that's the only reason I'm going to get that set probably is probably like that movie and I think there's one more. But I have a, a VHS of Robot Jocks and Robot Jocks and that's what it reminds me of. And then the last one I grabbed was Pompeii. I remember seeing this uh, once. I, I'm i going to give it a shot again. Keith Sutherland, I like his work, but he, I think he's only in here for a moment. I think he's like the father or something, or he's like the head security guy. I can't remember. It's been a while. But the visuals are pretty decent, um, you know, with the exploding volcano and everything, how it destroys Pompeii. So it ties history with visual and love and all that together. So action love adventure. <laughs> is, that, is that such a thing? Actually, it is really like romancing the stone. You know, stuff like that. Anyways, Jewel of the Nile. Um, this is the stack of the day for me. These are my pickups. Um, just a quick, quick Tuesday run through. You know, two spots, two grabs. Those still books alone you know, were enough. It's <laughs> all so I had to go to just the clearance area. But there was a lot they put out. A lot of new stuff that was out on the clearance racks. And I was like, okay, I had to stop. Uh, again, just a good place to build the collection. I know some of you guys uh, want to get your first air releases. I was actually just discussing this with a buddy <laughs> a little bit ago. So when I say wait and buy cheap, you know, dollar, two dollars, three, you can buy them cheap. Do what you want to do. You want a movie and you love that movie? Don't wait. If there's a release or a copy, an edition, don't wait. Because you know, if I like that movie, I'm going to get it. Uh, I still get things first day as well. I just try not to. So, And how I can get them is because I budget here. Uh, you know, I like when I was telling him, I don't need, you know, like Max the first day it comes out. I'll wait till it's a dollar. But something like... You know, I'm trying to think here. I don't know. Like, irreversible, maybe. You know, like, that. that's just, just sold out through Vinegar Syndrome. Um, had 2,000 copies, sold out in like a day. Crazy. You know, you never know. You never know with a movie what is going to happen. So, if you like the movie and you want that movie, get that movie. <laughs> like, like, don't wait. Where my name comes from on my Instagram. I want that movie. If I want it, it's coming home. You know, as you see. So, yeah. that That's the tip of the day to keep adding on to the advice the hunter can give to you. Yeah. Don't wait. Don't wait. Don't. It's going to be sold out, you know. But only if you want it. Only if you want it. Not because somebody else got it. Not because somebody else told you you should get it. Um, only if you want it. It's your money. Spend it the way you want. So other than that, like, subscribe, comment if you're enjoying yourself. I'm enjoying myself. Uh, I'm not going to keep this much going much longer. So later. <laughs>